Hi, and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm so excited to have you here. Please be sure to subscribe so that you won't miss any videos in the future. And please be sure to like this video if you find it helpful. Drop any comments below and I'll be sure to get back to you ASAP. Let's get started. Hello, thank you so much for joining me. I finally am getting around to giving you guys a flip through for February of 2024. So let's get started. Inside my first pages, um, in my pockets, I have lots of my freebie cards. These are all available for you for free download. Every month I do a different theme. You can find that link in my Instagram account, underscore plan J in Instagram. In the pocket here, I always have all of my micro icon uh, weather stickers from DC Papers. I give them just a little snip down the side so that they fit in here completely and then they don't, they don't wear out. Um, and then I have some more of her stickers behind here. These are the week numbers. This dashboard here is actually the free dashboard uh, that's available for Valentine's Day. I try to do a dashboard for every season and occasion. So you can find that in five sizes um, in the link in the bio on my website. These are some more of my free journaling cards. Um, and here are the plethora of regular stickers from Judy at Daisy Papers that I use. Um, these are just some really, really quick, cheap weekly stickers that I made myself just for all of my inserts. This is also available for free. Um, if you click the link in my bio in my Instagram handle, I'll see if I can figure out how to link it to this video for you as well. Um, and then these are also some three by three cards that I've made. Um, they fit perfectly in these pockets if you're in a personal size. Um, I haven't gotten them added to my Etsy shop yet, but I will get them up there soon. This is my week at a glance. This I printed on vellum. This is a PDF from Infinite Lotus. Um, and you can save on your next purchase with Jenny 8 um, at Infinite Lotus. So my first section is still my routines bundle. Um, this is like my brain power right here. So um, I won't go into it in super great detail right now, but you can take a look uh, through this bundle on their website. It is what keeps me so organized and I pair it with their daily routine um, sheet that you can customize, you can fill it before you print it. Um, and then this is just what I go through um, every day uh, when I start each morning with a nice cup of tea in my planner. Um, that's where I start um, and then I work my way through my schedule. So then I have my weeklies here. This is a set of 12 dashboards available on my Etsy shop if you're looking for just a really nice minimal um, title for each of your months. Um, it really pairs well with the numbered inserts that come. I like a month on four page just so I can separate things really nice. And I also really like the list that comes on the back of this insert. This is the month on four page lined insert from Infinite Lotus and my planner is a personal sized rings. My next section is my weekly section. Um, and these, these dashboards that you're seeing are part of my Valentine's Day dashboard series. It is a series of six and you can print them at home on vellum like I have or on any kind of paper or cardstock that you choose. This is the weekly spread that I use. This is a custom version of the MN205 from Infinite Lotus and you'll find them by putting an eight L-O-T-S U-S dot C-O, um, Infinite Lotus. So this is the uh, custom version. It just starts at five o'clock for me. So I think the original version starts at six and it goes till midnight. So I just asked Vivian for the customization of it starting at five because that's when I like to start my day. There's room for lists, for tasks for the week, a note section, 
um, which when I get around to it, I really, I like to put scripture there. Um, and then uh, a list section for each day as well. Like this is such a great layout. It comes in all different sizes. So if you're looking, if you're on, on the lookout for a really great uh, weekly, I highly recommend this one. My next section is my daily. This is another dashboard part of that Valentine's Day series. Um, this is the daily insert that I use. It's an undated version of, I believe it's the MN4T. Oh gosh, I can't remember now. I would have to look it up. Um, but again, she customized it for me to start um, at five o'clock. So I, I'm pretty sure it just started at six. So she just had it finish at 10. So um, we took we took one off here and added one at the top. Um, and it's absolutely perfect for me. Um, I like having a place to write everything going on that day. So I don't have to flip all around. I can just keep scribbling in notes every day as I go. Um, I like that it keeps me on track. Oh, sun's coming in here. It keeps me on track for my water um, and I can log my um, meals and my snacks. Um, and then up at the top, I like to squeeze in the highs and the lows and use those beautiful icon stickers from Judy. My next section is my work section. I like to keep my work schedule completely separate um, just because I am a substitute teacher. So my schedule is pretty hectic. So I just like to keep it um, separate and then I just block days off as I need to. Um, this is the same insert that I use in my personal life. I just use it exclusively here for work. And then this is the weekly grid layout from Infinite Lotus. I like to use this for work. It's got um, uh, a this week for any kind of notes up at the top. I don't really need um, the weekend in this case because I'm just using it for work days. Um, but you never know what you might need a new insert for what a new application might be. So that's the beauty of PDFs. <laughs> you have them forever. Um, and then this is a payroll verification insert that Rosie Patei made me. It's perfect. I filled it. I need to print another one. Um, my next section is my tracking section. So this is the Infinite Lotus Habit Tracker. But what I've done in my tracking section is I've modified it to track my mental health, my physical health, um, as well as my sleep total and my sleep times, and then also um, my exercise. So I have lots of trackers like specifically made for the, the, these purposes, but I just found them too complicated. Um, and I was really easily able to adapt the one that I, I had and I liked using because the, the graph stays on the same page. It doesn't go across the rings. So I really like this one. This is the tracker that I use to track my running. This was a yearly um, tracker from Planner Room on Etsy. This is my Bible tracker. Uh, I got this on Etsy too, but I can't remember who it's from. So if you're looking for one and you want to know the details, just send me a message. My next section is my journaling section. So I like to use the cover pages, which are a PDF download um, from Infinite Lotus to create like a section for each month. Um, and then what I like to do is I like to print my inserts back to back. So I have like the weekly review built right into my daily journal. Um, and I do that throughout the month. Um, and then when I get to the end of the month, I finish it off with a monthly review. So again, the beauty of PDFs is you can create a personal flow for your section um, of whatever you download um, in your planner for the way that it works for you. This is a free printable from Noted Co. Next up, I have my cleaning section. I love this insert. Um, I really like using the micro icons from Judy for all of the different cleaning tasks that I like to do each week, but you can of course um, fill it out um, and handwrite everything in. I just really love using her stickers. Um, and then again, I use that, that freebie week of sticker to date, all of these inserts. Um, I use those 
um, in my journaling, weekly reviews as well. So I just, I don't know, I just like the clean look of a dated sticker versus my handwriting. Um, this, the sun is really creeping in here. Let me just pull that line just a little bit so that you can see this. Um, this is my spring, summer, and autumn winter activity lists. I just finished creating these. I'm really excited about them. Um, they are available on my Etsy shop uh, in five different sizes. So the spring and summer is one download and autumn. Winter is a different. So depending on which hemisphere you're in, you can buy the one um, that you need right now and then you have it forever. So um, just to take a quick look, all of the activities are kind of seasonal based. Um, they're non-specific to where you live, but different kinds of seasonal activities and then lots of space for you to fill in the lines with special uh, activities that you uh, do in your hometown. My next section is my notes section. And that's pretty straightforward. We don't need to go through that. Then I have my social media section. This is where I keep a list um, of what I post and when I post. Um, and just trying to stay consistent with um, different forms of posting and interactive stories. I find writing things down keeps me in a really good routine um, and routine has really helped my growth. Um, and then I also use, this is the inbox checklist from uh, Infinite Lotus, but I just manipulated it before I printed it. Um, so it says social checklist and I got rid of the words that were in the columns so that I could print it out myself and then I just use this as my checklist as I come up with new products um, and then creating them in all the different sizes and then when I get them uploaded onto my shop and then I use the back side for all of my freebie ideas um, and then I'm on to my second page for freebies already. I love making you guys freebies. There's so many freebies um, in my file. So if you don't already follow me on Instagram, you should check it out. Um, and then you'll always be able to log in because I'm constantly adding um, as the seasons come. These, uh, oh, this is something that I just added. So this is a month on four page freebie that I made. Sometimes we're like playing around with sizes and we wanna try a new size, but that can get really expensive. Or maybe we've just started planning and we're overwhelmed at how expensive the habit is. So I wanted, since I started this space here about a year ago, I wanted to create um, free inserts for people to use and access. And I finally did it. So this is the month on four pages. So these are stickers up at the top. So you can make it a Monday start or a Sunday start. You don't need to use stickers. You can just write it. Um, but I had these stickers, so I wanted to use them. These are some stickers that I've made. Um, they're available free for download from my link as well. So it's got a title page, so you can separate it by month. And then there's space for notes on the back. This is my week on one page. Um, so this is available in a Sunday and a Monday start. Um, and then you just fill in the number and highlight the month. I also made it in a grid. Um, so again, available in a Monday and a Sunday start. And then I also made the, the month uh, on four pages. I also made it available in a month on two pages. So if you just want your months to like consistently flip from page to page, um, I made that as well. So this is what it looks like before you fill it out. So you can see you can make it a Monday or Sunday start, whatever you prefer. You can highlight the month and just fill out the year over here. And then there's a whole column for notes. The last section that I have in my planner is my budget section. Um, the sheet that I use is the weekly expenses and I just like to keep track of the uh, variable expenses. So like we have our budget set for all of our fixed payments and bills and things like that. And I just find like the task of writing everything I buy out um, really helps us manage our spending. And then I just have some more of my fun free planner cards at the back. The very back is my wallet, so it's not too exciting. Um, but yeah, so that is my setup for February. It has been treating me really well. I'm sorry it's 
pretty much the last week of February when I'm getting this to you, but I hope the month has treated you well. And if it hasn't, spring is on its way. Um, and with that, fresh weather and warmer temperatures. So wherever your day takes you today, I hope it goes according to plan. Take care.